What up guys, Savvy Echo here, and welcome back to the sesh. Now, I know it's been like four or five months since I've done a video, but I just want to say thanks to all the people that have been watching the vids, that have commented and uh, have stuck around. But uh, this is the comeback vid, I am going to be doing more videos, there's a lot of stuff that I've gotten that I haven't, you know, reviewed and unboxed. Uh, you know, I've checked to see that, make sure my order's came in of what I ordered but I haven't fully like checked every single item but without further ado uh for the comeback the first vid right now is the Emerald City Comic Con Alien Rick and uh Alien Morty from Hot Topic and I usually get this shipped to the store but this time around I went ahead and got it shipped to my house uh these have already been opened I already went through them I just put them back in here for safekeeping and uh Pretty much the way it came was with the, uh, this, this brown paper, and they each came individually wrapped in the bubble wrap, but like I said, I've already gone through them, and, uh, for the most part, the Mortys just had, like, a crease in the back, right here in the box, it's just a line, and pretty much if I put, like, a, put it in a, in a book, that should fix that problem right away, but, uh, for anybody who has issues like that, usually put it in a book or something heavy and uh, it'll straighten out. And as far as the alien ricks came, uh, only one of them came like slightly damaged. And uh, other than that, you know, I can't really complain too much. Just wish they would have double boxed them. But uh, the damage on the rick is pretty much just like, like, a, like a thumb crease right there. Like somebody grabbed it wrong or something. Maybe while they were packing it, and a uh, slight little tear to the corner. But other than that, like I said, they came in pretty awesome. So, and I'm really excited for these, and uh, just going to go into a little more detail on, like, which episode they appear and all that stuff. But uh, just once again, thanks to the people watching the vids and for sticking around. And uh, a lot of unboxings coming, but I'll take these out of the box, and uh, we'll take a closer look. Cool. Alright guys, so here are the Pops, uh, pretty much just going to give you a 360 view of the uh, Pops themselves, and a uh, quick background history, and uh, pretty much where they make their appearance is uh, Season 1, Episode 10, Close Recounters of the Rick Kind, and in this episode, you're shown the vast majority of dimensions that all contain an alternate Rick and Morty, and uh, these guys didn't come out in the episode for too long. It was very quick, and you definitely saw other personas of them, and I'm hoping if they do make more of these guys from that particular episode, they uh, make Fish Rick and Fish Morty, because they have uh, fish bowl helmets, and whenever they do a pop with that helmet-like, you know, effect, detail, you know, molding, I guess you would say, of the pop, uh... They always come out great, it just looks awesome, and uh, I'm hoping they do that. And another hope pop I hope to see is uh, Hammerhead Morty. That would be, I think, just fun and awesome. But uh, I'll go ahead and take these guys out and uh, show you a closer look at the pops themselves. But uh, another cool duo would probably be the, uh, the Cyclops. Rick and Morty, that'd be pretty cool. They got a great color scheme on them, and they only have one eyeball. So that would be another fun pop to see in pop form. And uh, I'm going to leave the boxes back here just to show you the other pops that they've also taken out for this uh, run. I think this is wave three, if I'm not mistaken. It might be. But uh, pretty much uh, you got prison... Break Rick, Santian Arm Morty, Warrior Summer, Hemorrhage, and uh, Rick Facehugger. And uh, for those particular series, uh, there is a chase, the Santian Arm Morty, there's, they have a bloody thumbs up version of that. And Rick Facehugger is a GameStop exclusive, so keep an eye out for those. They should be out in stores already uh and we'll do a review on a couple of those but that's a video for another day but like i said 
they showed a vast majority of alternate Rick and Mortys and uh, this set came out great uh, right away what sticks out is pretty much the uh, the antennas here uh, the three eyeballs and definitely the arms and as far as it going into the details I'm really digging these whole uh, facial line expressions that they have it's awesome really dig that and of course the uh, mouth decals now not all pops have these but for this particular line of the Rick and Morty series I think uh, this is just a really nice addition and they look great they don't look weird so I'm hoping to keep doing that but uh, definitely an awesome set to own the color is great like I said the antennas are cool uh, the arms definitely great they stick out if you have them out of the box but uh, I would recommend if you do take them out of the box to uh, you know not put them too high up on a shelf or on a stand because uh, they do fall I feel like the antennas would break off easily and that would totally suck so uh, like always they do a great job there as far as paint wise uh, there's a, there is a couple of paint bleeds you know like by where the hair and the head connects but nothing too crazy and uh, Rick does have his bald spot in the back and that's always great to see those little details little smudging on the coat nothing too crazy see if maybe there's a way to fix that but you know these things happen with pops and uh, of course they got their classic outfits on but uh, if you are looking to get this set they are still available at hottopic.com I'll post a link on the video below and other than that I mean definitely a set to own I hope you enjoyed the video like comment subscribe uh, let me know if you guys uh, would like to you know maybe there's a particular duo that you saw because there was definitely a lot more characters and they also did introduce evil Rick and Morty in this episode and they have made evil Morty into a pop as well as doofus Rick that was also introduced in the episode so I'll do a review on those later but uh like I said awesome job on these the ears look great nice and pointy and just the overall you know extra body features are great but uh like I said thanks for watching stick around more videos coming and thank you to the people that have subscribed you know and I haven't done a video in about like I want to say three four months but uh definitely got a lot more subscribers now and uh thank you guys for sticking around and uh See you soon. Laters.